Is it time to buy or sell SoFi stock? In this video, we're diving deep into SoFi. Our initial report was published on our website on Tuesday, the 30th of July, 2024, and now we're here to provide you with an even more detailed analysis. Remember to subscribe, hit the like button, and turn on the notification bell to stay updated on our latest analysis. You don't want to miss any crucial updates that could impact your investments. Enhance your trading decisions by trying our newly launched AI stock analysis tool powered by GPT-4 at stockinvest.us. Tap into the power of AI and get a free price prediction and deep analysis for anyone among 25,000 companies worldwide today. Please note that this video is for informational purposes only and should not be considered as financial advice. Since the 30th of July, 2024, our system has ranked SoFi as a buy candidate, assigning it a score of 1.67. Now let's examine the stock's performance during this time period. We will continue to monitor this evaluation to observe how it develops in the coming days. The stock is moving within a wide and horizontal trend, and further movements within this trend can be anticipated. The current three-month trend suggests a potential change of approximately 1.11% over the next three months, with a possible return ranging from negative 13.38% to positive 7.01%. Regarding the 12-month trend, it indicates a change of negative 16.64% over the next 12 months, with a possible return between negative 39.88% and positive 3.81%. This translates to a price range of $4.46 to $7.70 after one year. Our latest daily update for SoFi highlights the significant fluctuations in its stock price on Tuesday, which concluded trading at $7.42. On the most recent trading day, the SoFi stock experienced an increase of 1.23%, rising from $7.33 to $7.42. Throughout the day, the stock varied by 11.81%, reaching a low of $7.11 and a high of $7.95. Despite this volatility, the price has shown a downward trend over the past two weeks, resulting in a loss of 4.26%. Notably, trading volume increased on the last day alongside the price, which is a positive technical indicator, with a total of 26 million more shares traded compared to the previous day. Overall, 90 million shares changed hands, amounting to approximately $666,600,000. Looking back over the past 52 weeks, the highest stock price reached was $11.10, while the lowest was $6.15. Currently, the price is 33.15%, or $3.68, below the 52-week high, and 73.74%, or $20.84, below the all-time high of $28.26, which occurred on the 1st of February, 2021. SoFi Technologies has made headlines recently following the release of its second quarter 2024 earnings, which showed robust growth and surpassed analysts' expectations on both revenue and earnings. The financial services segment led the charge, boasting an impressive 80% year-over-year growth, highlighting the company's effective strategy in navigating the current market environment. Despite this solid performance, SoFi stock has seen a decline, trading lower in the immediate aftermath of the earnings report. This contrast presents a potential buying opportunity, given the stock is currently considered undervalued. According to valuation models, SoFi stock is estimated to be worth around $22.53 per share, suggesting significant upside potential from current prices. Analysts project a healthy five-year compound annual growth rate of approximately 37.57%, reinforcing the view that this could be a strong long-term investment. Additionally, the company aims to position itself as the Amazon Web Services of financial services, indicating a strategic shift towards technology and innovation, 
which is expected to drive future growth and profitability. Moreover, recent guidance updates reflect management's confidence as the company raised its profit forecasts for the second time this year, signaling resilience despite economic headwinds. However, the stock's lack of immediate upward momentum, despite positive earnings, could reflect broader market sentiment towards fintech stocks, which have struggled recently amidst shifting investor focus. Analyst Ratings On Tuesday, the 9th of July, 2024, it was reported that Barclays assigned Sophie an equal weight grade with a hold action. On Tuesday, the 2nd of July, 2024, it was reported that Needham assigned Sophie a buy grade with a hold action. On Tuesday, the 2nd of July, 2024, it was reported that Needham also assigned Sophie an underperform grade with a hold action. On Tuesday, the 2nd of July, 2024, it was reported that Wedbush assigned Sophie a market perform grade with a hold action. On Friday, the 7th of June, 2024, it was reported that Wedbush again assigned Sophie a market perform grade with a hold action. Analysts have assigned a general sell rating to SoFi stock. They evaluate the price to earnings ratio as sell and the price to book ratio as sell. Regarding return on investment, the analysts provide the stock with a neutral rating. The following signals have been identified for SoFi. The SoFi stock presents buy signals from both short-term and long-term moving averages, indicating a positive outlook for the stock. Additionally, there is a general buy signal due to the relationship between these two averages, with the short-term average positioned above the long-term average. During downward corrections, support is expected from the levels of $7.36 and $6.88. A drop below either of these levels would trigger sell signals. Furthermore, a buy signal has emerged from the three-month moving average convergence divergence, or MACD. Observations show that volume is increasing alongside the price, which is typically viewed as a favorable technical signal. However, some negative signals have also been noted, which could impact near-term developments. A sell signal was generated from a pivot top point on Wednesday, the 17th of July, 2024, and so far, the stock has declined by 5.36%. Further declines are anticipated until a new bottom pivot is established. Here are some additional signals that may capture your interest. Moving average convergence divergence indicates a buy signal. Pivots signaled a sell action 10 days ago. Bollinger Bands suggested a buy move 11 days ago. Short-term moving average signaled a buy 4 days ago. Long-term moving average signaled a buy 15 days ago. The relationship between the short and long moving averages indicated a buy signal 12 days ago. When examining the 12-month chart, we observe short moving average indicated a buy signal 16 days ago. Long-term moving average signaled a sell action 6 days ago. The relationship between the short and long moving averages suggested a buy signal 94 days ago. For more signals, remember to visit our page at stockinvest.us. Support, Risk and Stop Loss for SoFi So finds support from accumulated volume at $7.33, and this level may present a buying opportunity, as an upward reaction can be expected when the support is tested. This stock may experience significant movement during the day, indicating high volatility. With a large prediction interval from the Bollinger Band, this stock is classified as high risk. In the previous day, the stock fluctuated by 84 cents between its high and low, which represents an 11.81% change. Over the past week, the stock has exhibited an average daily volatility of 6.07%. Before we dive into the potential trading levels for SoFi, let's quickly cover some essential fundamental data. First, let's discuss the price to earnings ratio, commonly referred to as the PE ratio. This important metric assesses a company's current share price in relation to its earnings per share. A negative PE ratio indicates that the company is experiencing negative earnings or is incurring losses. 
Even well-established companies can go through downturns, often due to factors beyond their control. However, consistently negative P.E. ratios may suggest inadequate profitability and could raise concerns about potential bankruptcy risks. In other news, the upcoming earnings report for the third quarter of 2024 is anticipated on the 28th of October, 2024. Now, let's discuss some potential day trading levels for SoFi. In case of an upward trend, the first resistance level for SoFi is at $7.47. If you do not own any shares, you may want to wait for this level to be surpassed before entering a position. For those already holding the stock, this could be a level to consider for swing trading. On the downside, SoFi encounters its first support level at $7.33. If this support level holds, it could present a favorable entry point, anticipating a rebound. The combined average rating for SoFi from various analyst sources is classified as a sell. Now let's examine some recent insider trades. On the 8th of July, 2024, Simc Steven executed an insider purchase of 1,141,650 shares of restricted stock unit. On the 1st of July, 2024, Simcox Steven executed an insider purchase of zero shares. On the 27th of June, 2024, Meltzer Gary executed an insider purchase of zero shares. On the 27th of June, 2024, Borden William A. executed an insider purchase of zero shares. On the 20th of June, 2024, Rishal Jeremy executed an insider sale of 56,273 shares of common stock. Analyzing the 100 most recent insider trades, we have determined that the insider power is negative, with a ratio of negative 42.331. In total, insiders acquired 11,769,229 shares and sold 27 million 571,780 shares in the last 100 trades. Our recommended stop loss is set at $7.09, reflecting a decrease of 4.43%. This stock exhibits significant daily fluctuations, which introduces a higher level of risk. Furthermore, a sell signal has been indicated from a pivot top identified 27 days ago. Is SoFi stock a good buy? Several short-term indicators are looking positive, suggesting that the current level may present a buying opportunity. There is a reasonable chance for SoFi stock to perform well in the near term. Our analysis has been updated since the last evaluation, changing our recommendation from a sell to a buy candidate. After examining the volatility and movements from the most recent trading day, our systems indicate that the current price appears undervalued. For trading on Wednesday, the 31st of July, we anticipate SoFi to open with an increase of approximately $0.07, cents, starting trading at around $7.49. It is important to remember that trading carries a significant risk of financial loss. We strongly recommend consulting with a financial advisor before making any decisions regarding the purchase or sale of securities. Your investment choices should not solely rely on information from stockinvest.us. By utilizing this information, you acknowledge and accept responsibility for your own investment actions. This is our current view of the stock. Do you agree or disagree? Please share your thoughts in the comments below. What is your target for the stock? Remember to like and subscribe. We wish you successful trading and hope you have a wonderful day with warm regards from everyone here at Stock Invest.